Many construction companies do amazing work and are able to scale their company to a certain extent with very minimal marketing and outbound sales strategies solely relying on client referrals. Eventually, these companies hit a wall and are left asking, how can I get more leads for my construction company? The first and arguably most important part of acquiring more leads for your company is identifying your target market. You should be able to identify in just a few sentences what you're offering and be able to pair that offering with specific people that are in need of your services. Once you're able to make that connection, you're able to focus more on who to market to and who to sell to. In a book written by construction expert David Gertzel, he describes the principle of your client ring. This is a great principle to apply when identifying your target market and who to start selling to. Leads that are closer to you inside of this client ring are easier and more cost effective to sell and usually a great place to start. As you get further and further from you in the client ring, you're able to reach more people but may have to implement some more creative strategies to reach these people effectively. In this video, we'll talk about some strategies that focus on reaching the people closest to you in this client ring but can be applied on a broader scale. Let's start by taking a look at some of these strategies. First, knock the surrounding doors. This is one of my favorites for a few reasons. One, it's free. Two, it reaches members of your client's community. And third, it's a great way and low pressure way to get your name and business out there. This sales strategy goes something like this. While working in a residential community or neighborhood, print out a quick flyer, it can be super simple, something you make in a Google Doc or Word Doc, and print that flyer out. Take your flyer and knock the five surrounding doors in that neighborhood next to your client's house. Deliver the flyer to the neighbors and let them know they may see some trucks and some of your workers in the area over the next few weeks. Give them a quick pitch, let them know your crews will be in the area, and offer to help with any remodeling services that they may need. This is a super low pressure way to introduce yourself, build trust with the community, and potentially land some new leads. Even if these homeowners don't need any work done right now, they now have the name of a trustworthy contractor that's great at communicating that they may have in mind for their next project. An easy follow-up for these leads is stopping by at the end of the project, thanking them for their flexibility, and then giving them one last quick pitch before you leave the area. The second strategy is to connect with local real estate agents. One of the fastest ways to add value to a home before selling it is remodeling. Kitchens, bathrooms, exteriors, new paint. If any of these are services that you offer, reach out and connect with local real estate agents offering to provide those services and potentially offer them a quick referral bonus. You can also double dip on some of these leads because if a customer has bought a new house, they may need remodels done, new flooring installed, or new paint applied. This is a great strategy to create that recurring business and build great relationships with these agents. The third strategy is to make sure your clients don't forget you. The easiest leads to sell are ones you've already sold in the past, but oftentimes customers forget about the contractors that have done good work for them in the past. Make sure that you're the contractor that they think of for their next project. A few ways you can do this is to send a postcard or mailer or reach out to customers during a warranty period on a project you've completed for them. This keeps their name fresh in your mind and gives you the opportunity to come back and do a quick fix on a job you may have installed. Send a postcard or mailer for holidays, special events, or updated company news. Connect with clients on social media and ask their permission to post photos of the work that you've completed inside their home and even tag those clients in those posts. Provide tips on recommended maintenance for work you've done previously. If you used a special material or appliance, make sure your customer knows how to take care of that down the road. And last, don't be afraid to ask for references for work well done. Clients remember and like to thank contractors who've done great work and ask for those reviews. There are many ways to reconnect with clients and make sure you're top of mind for their next project. If you can turn one sale into two, three, or four sales over the next few months, that's a great way to increase leads. An important note is that you'll always get referral leads when you do good work. But the gold mine is an active approach to client engagement and client relationships. The last strategy is to work with local suppliers and my favorite, get in the showroom. A flooring company that I've worked with in the past told me a story that they were able to get their sales reps on the floor of a local flooring supply company. 
they were able to help this supplier sell more of their product and then became the preferred installer as customers purchased those materials. This was a win-win for both parties. It did require a little bit of networking, but a great source of new leads and new revenue for that business. Increasing the quantity of leads is great, but making sure you're making the most of every lead you receive is even more important. Sales and leads are the lifeblood of any construction company, and it's important to make sure those leads don't slip through the cracks. It's all too common for contractors to store their lead information in their text messages, the notes app of their phone, paper notes and sticky notes, or a million different spreadsheets that nobody in the company has access to. The problem is that contractors are losing leads that they have the potential to sell. The solution is a lead pipeline to track and manage those leads effectively. This is where Progel comes in. Progel provides a construction specific pipeline to track and manage leads, schedule follow-ups, create and send estimates in a timely manner, and store all of your client information for future follow-ups. To learn more how Progel can help you organize your leads and increase your revenue, check out the link in the description below or visit our website at Progel.com. Be sure to leave a comment with some other sales strategies that you use that may help your fellow contractors. Happy selling!